So I'm out here at Little Baja and I'm with Jared. And Jared, uh, we're gonna be talking about several things today, but first of all, let's talk about wood for the chimneys that you guys sell. Sure, sure. Well, at uh, Falls here, a lot of folks are gonna be burning in their chimneys. Uh, we just wanna remind everyone to choose some clean, dry wood. Now, what, what exactly does that mean? I understand the dry part, but what do you mean clean wood? Sure, well, you wanna stay away from anything that's been treated um, yeah. with creosote or stained or painted. Um, try to avoid going and grabbing boards off your old shack out in the back, <laughs> things like that. Just uh, get some nice uh, seasoned wood. Here we have some kindling. It makes it nice to start your fire nice and slow in the chimneys. So nice. that is real helpful because they're all cut to a good size. And then uh, we have a bundle, a little bit larger pieces. Um, it's a mixture of hardwoods and uh, we get it from a local uh, co-op and they do a really great job of making sure it's the best wood. It nice. smells good, it burns clean, it lasts a long time. And what are these? Um, those are a Presto Laga, uh, it's basically compressed wood fibers. It burns just like a hardwood. It's all natural, no chemicals or uh, wax or anything like that. Um, just also a reminder, since we're talking about fire logs, stay away from any of the instant light ones. You just want an all natural fire log that you'll ignite with kindling. And I'm sure too, if you get the right kind of wood, then you're not gonna have all of that smoke, which can really become a hassle. You're right, your neighbors will love you yeah. for it. Your <laughs> friends and family, it'll be enjoyable. It's really worth it. Now you also have gotten a, a big load of different stuff in new. So let's talk a little bit about that. Most definitely, we've got a huge shipment in, uh, with some new styles that really kind of target that nice, plain, contemporary, smooth, like this stuff. Exactly like that. And it, this is cool. Yeah. So who do you find is liking this stuff? Um, I'd say the millennials for yeah, sure. Right? Yeah. Uh -huh. But Jared, these clean lines aren't just in the concrete. Not at all. We have plenty in the terracotta as well. You know, there's also a big passion for color right now. So tell us about that company and what oh, you're doing. Oh, most here. definitely. Um, we've been bringing up some really nice Talavera pottery here. Um, this is a real special product. They, uh, each piece undergoes multiple firings and it's all hand done and uh, they just come out one of a kind, really unique and color is in. Yeah, it really is and I love this stuff because not only not only is it colorful, but it's also great for outdoor or indoor use. Right. So you can just move it right into your house. Exactly. When you're kind of packing everything in for uh, the winter, you can just set that up on the windowsill. It looks really nice, bring you that color all year round. And you also got a lot of really great new chimneys, both out of the terracotta and of metals. Sure, sure. We can go take a look. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. So now, Jared, I'm going to call this the Hall of the Chimeneas because there's a lot here. Uh, tell me about what it is about that these that needs to be cured. I don't understand that. Well, you just start it nice and slow, and having that uh, small cuts of kindlings really makes that easy. You yeah. build like a little log cabin with the kindling, holds a newspaper right in the middle, gets that going. Five or ten minutes of that is really going to take the chill out of the clay, and then you're good to go. You can add your bigger pieces of wood. Well, and then also, what about the, the winter? Is there anything you need to do specifically? These are pretty much fine outdoors year-round. Um, it is a good idea to put a cap over the top and yeah. make sure the ashes are cleaned out if you're not going to be burning. Perfect. In it. Well, for more information, we always invite you to go to gardentime.tv. We'll click you over to their website. Come on out, pick up some great wood, some beautiful chimneys, and some wonderful pottery for your own place. Thanks a lot, Jerry. Awesome.